वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम वन पॉइंट फोर वन सो स्टेटमेंट इज लिंक ए बी इज टू मेड ऑफ स्टील फॉर विच अल्टीमेट नॉर्मल स्ट्रेस इज फोर फिफ्टी मेगा पासकल डिटरमाइन द क्रॉस सेक्शनल एरिया ऑफ ए बी फॉर विच फैक्टर ऑफ सेफ्टी विल बी थ्री पॉइंट फाइव जीरो इज्यूम दैट लिंक विल बी एडिकुएटली री एनफोर्स अराउंड पिन ए एन बी सो यू कैन सी दिस इज लिंक ए बी दैट इज पिन सपोर्ट एट पॉइंट ए एन बी एन बी हैव अनदर मेम्बर दैट इज बी ई having uniformly distributed load of 8 kN per meter or the length of 1.2 meter at point c we have a load of 20 kN and at point d we have a pin support that is at point d so you have to find the cross sectional area ab of the uh, this link ab so for that we will need force in ab so what we will do we will take this member as a member bc and we will draw the free body diagram that various force acting on it from that we will get fab so let's start with the solution also you can see that uh, i will show you that this 8 kN is uniformly distributed load and this is when converted into a point load so it will be 8 into total length is 1.2 meter uh this uh, 1.2 and this is 8 and that will give you 9.6 kilo newton and that will be acting at 0.6 meter from this end so this will be 0.6 so this is 0.2 so this distance will be equal to 0.2 2 so what we will do we will draw the free body diagram of this member so let this is the member clear this is your point b where you have fab this is fab you can see and this angle is 35 degree at point c we have a 20 kN load this is 20 kN load this is your point c this is your point d when you remove this support so there will be a reaction force in x direction which is dx and there will be a vertical reaction which is dy this will be dy okay there is a point p load uh, due to this uniformly distributed load and this is this p is equal to 9.6 kilo newton which is already over here okay from b this distance is 0.4 meter here this distance from this is 0.2 which is shown over here and from d to end this distance is again 0.4 and the, this middle distance is also 0.4 meter now we will apply equilibrium condition to get this fd so what will be the equilibrium condition that sum of all moment about point d is equal to 0 and taking the counter clockwise moment as positive so this is point d so first moment will be uh, due to this force p into perpendicular distance is 0.2 and it is producing clockwise moment so it will be positive the other moment will be this 20 kN and perpendicular distance is 0.4 and this will be also counter clockwise so it will be positive the third moment will be due to the vertical component of this force which is fab into sin of 35 degree and perpendicular distance is 0.8 and this is producing clockwise moment so it will be negative so i will write if i draw the vertical component of this force so this force will be equal to fab into sin of 35 degree so i will write fab into sin of 35 degree perpendicular distance is 0.8 and it is producing clockwise so it will be negative plus 20 into 0.4 you can see this 20 and perpendicular distance is this 0.4 plus 
9.6 into perpendicular distance is 0 0.2 their sum must be equal to 0 so from here you will get this FAB force in member AB or force due to member AB will be equal to 21.619 kilo Newton or in Newton it will be equal to 21.619 into 10 to the power 3 Newton now you have force in this member layer so you can find the stress in AB which is equal to force in AB divided by area in AB also we know that ultimate stress is equal to uh, uh, sorry we will start from factor of safety so that you can easily learn okay so we will choose sometimes sensor does not work so we will choose it manually okay we know that factor of safety is equal to ultimate strength divided by the working stress uh, stress clear so we know that this stress working stress which is we if we are talking about a b so that will be equal to ultimate stress divided by factor of safety so sigma a b is equal to let this is equation number one and this is your equation number two so equating equate equation one and two we will get f a b over area a b is equal to sigma ultimate divided by factor of safety now you have f a b you have ultimate strength you have factor of safety so from here you will get area a b is equal to f a b into factor of safety divided by ultimate strength so you can just put area of a b is equal to f a b is 21.619 into 10 to power 3 multiplied by factor of safety is 3.50 divided by ultimate stress which is 450 megapascal so 450 into 10 to power 6 and when you calculate it you will get 168.1 into 10 to power minus 6 square meter this is the area of member AB and in term of millimeter this will be equal to 168.1 milli square millimeter and this is the answer of our question which is 11.41 I hope you have enjoyed this video those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest video if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching